the difference between trying to teach somebody something that is hard to understand or teaching somebody something that is obvious is quite apparent. And I can teach people anything they want to know based on if they can simplify what they thought they've known already. And with that being said, it's more like when someone's trying to explain to you a really hard, detailed process and you have to take it all in and apply it some certain way. That's one thing. But as simple as saying you don't want to put poison in your body, so therefore you should pay attention to what's in the stuff you put in your body. You don't want to, you know, accidentally lead yourself into thinking bad things and enjoying bad things. So therefore you want to make sure you pay attention to what you watch and pay attention to. Then you actually want to make sure that you tell people that you care about what is harming them. I mean, those are pretty obvious things. And then one that's even more obvious is the whole thing that I mention a lot, that someone else is going to come tell you everything that you're going to do with your life, and you don't have to worry about making any of your own decisions because they're going to tell you how it's done, and you're just going to listen. Now, that would sound almost absurd for somebody to think that, well, don't, don't tell me that, don't tell me that you're going to control my life. But then I could say, somebody already is. You just don't see them in person, and their life is affecting your life in much more of a way than, my, than I am until you start implying it or implementing it and start living for yourself. It won't be for me. If you do anything that I teach you, it'll be for you. Everything that other people are trying to teach you, it's for them. And that should be pretty easy to understand. Just because you're scared of standing up for what's true doesn't mean I'm not. Because it means, like, literally, I am. I'm standing up for the truth. And I've got so much to offer that there's, there's, I can't. I, I could not lie at this point. All I know is what is. And I know how to fix it. And with the ability to do that, I have to. And if not, then somebody ought to tell me where I'm, where I'm going wrong with caring about everybody. And uh, if not, then suggest what I should do with the knowledge that I have. Because they can't tell me to just can it and forget about it because uh, it includes them. I'm not going to can them and forget about them. And just because they're doing, some of them are doing very harmful things and very wrong things to others, doesn't mean I don't care enough to help and try to correct things, make things better for everybody. Because somebody cares about them, they care about somebody, no one deserves to lose their loved ones, and if they're contributing to that being done, then someone's got to help them fix up, because if we just take them out, that's not taking out the ideas of that, those people are still, they're, they're in groups of people who do this, so if you take one out, or help one out just a little bit, or remove them from situation, or punish them, it's not doing anything. Punishment is just going to cause fear for others, so they're going to try to hide it, or they definitely won't come forward about it. We've got to, to work on stuff and really take it as it is and, and, you know, apply yourself moment to moment. I'm not going to go much more on this one because I wanted to make it simple. Just saying, the whole point of this little detailed talk was about making sure that you understand that simple things can be simply explained. You own you. No one else does. When you really understand that, you can't follow a man-made law. All you can do is be your best self and learn how to show that and be that for others. And especially yourself and for living this itself. Peace.